Lord, Lord, if we will come, I will not go quietly. But it has to do with in God. You know, if we see something as Christians, you know, that isn't right, and we should speak up about it. No. We're supposed to be representative of the Christian faith. And uh, I believe that if we don't speak up, that we're just like the rest of the world, you know, we've been turning the other way, ignoring things, uh, choosing to uh, not address a certain issue because the person is your friend, you want to co-sign for them. So, uh, you know, that's what it's going to be about. You know, we all be talking to each other. And if we see something being wrong, you know, something being wrong, that could be us next time. That could be your kid next time. That could be your mom next time. You know? But we gotta, we gotta, you know, we gotta address these issues. You know, even if it comes to the dress put them on flat, and you pull them aside, you know, hey, it's too late to call them. And there's all kinds of, you know, all these other brothers. In this very tunnel here, 15, 17 years ago, this is two blocks away from the police academy. I used to score my heroin, come down in here, I used to shoot up in here, you know? And I come back to replay this plan for the kingdom of Jesus Christ. You know, there's all kinds of injustice, exploitations that go on. You know what I'm saying? And then the recovery world that's going on now. You know, recovery is a big thing right now. And there's a lot of people that are exploiting the men and women that are out there trying to change their lives. You know, they're, um, you know, taking it for their money. They're taking it for their money. Um, not really giving them the support and treating them as they need. You know, so I just want to address those issues. Uh, and uh, we should shape up because people are watching us. You know, we have to, you know, address the situation so we can make a better tomorrow. You know, to correct the mistakes that we've made in the past. Uh, you know, we should be part of the solution, not uh, be an instigator or advocate the situation. You know, sometimes you stay by someone and you know what you want to do or you know because there is some kind of twist and loyalty that we think we owe them, you know, that oh you know, this is a holy or you know, say this is my idea or this is uh, my best friend, so we co-sign for, for the wrong doing, you know, it's not right. You know, also, you know, sometimes We've been so dirty, you know? But the, 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 the solution is not to dirty ourselves and roll around in the mud, you know what I'm saying? That's it. And then, and then you know, for a we're all smeared up with whatever it is, you know, whatever sin, and then we go smear it out with someone else. Because, uh, you know, we've been, we've been dirty, so now we find out, we want to be dirty. And that's not the solution. You know, there's a lot of things in the media that they do. You know, uh, we watch these shows, you know, uh, Jerry Springer, you know, what can we say to you, he says, you know, all, all this junk and all this fun is to make us a, a participant of that, because what that does is it, it's getting paid, it's getting glory to the state, you know what I'm You may not be acting that way, but, you know, these stations out there, they're making money off of people's pain, you know what I'm saying, what is that with you? So I'm not going to keep quiet about it, you know, you know speak it out. And hope everybody hears what I'm saying, you know, because it's the truth. That's what, that's what it's found in here, it's the truth. So I'm going to get into a few pieces of scripture here. The first one. It's Romans 12. Don't let people conquer you, but conquer evil by doing good. Next one is First Corinthians 16, 13. Be on guard, stand firm in the faith, be courageous, be strong. The next one is Ephesians 6, 10. In final work, be strong in the Lord and in His mighty power. Ephesians 
6, 19, and pray for him too. And God can give him the right words for the goal he will take out of this The Spirit is present that the good news is for the Jews and the Gentiles alike. I have been chased out so we will be confessing the God's ambassador. So pray that I will keep on speaking boldly to him and I should. The next one is Second Timothy 4 5. But you should be clear, a clear mind in every situation. Don't be afraid of suffering for the Lord. Work on telling others the good news and fully carry on. Don't carry out the ministry God has given you. First Peter 5 5 8. Stay alert, watch out for your great enemy, the devil. He crawls around like a roaming lion, looking the soul to the power, and for the gentleman as he's brought to your faith. Remember that the Christian brothers and sisters all over the world are born to the same time as you are. Now, I'm glad that you said, you know, uh, guys, you know, we feel, uh, you know, sometimes we go on stage, it's a bit because we're, uh, embarrassed of, uh, you know, uh, trying to change it to ourselves, embarrassed that it's just such a cool thing to do, but, uh, you know, when you see someone, and, and, and you know, say, you know, being in the neighborhood, and you see someone that's even both the kids, you know, I say, turn it in, what I'm saying is hit them up. How would, they, how would you like to invite so folks to your kids? You know what I'm saying? How would you like to invite your church to this crowd? You know? Put, put, put the conviction on them. You know? They might not even vote it off, but I believe that it's taking them ahead. Because if they have any kind of heart, it'll work on them. You know what I'm saying? And I know one day that conviction will fall hard and not fall down tough on them. And then they'll realize that what, you, what they're doing is wrong. You know, and logic always speaks, so it goes around and comes around. You know? so I'm sure if you're not going to speak, they know that. So if they're doing what you're saying, if they're in a crowd of children, get jerked out, struck out, hey, it happens to you, hey. So, uh, with that being said, I'd like to pray as the Spirit of the Lord for protection of this video. Father God, in Jesus' name, I pray, Father God, for your protection against the enemy, Father God, for anybody who might come against me, Father God, my family, my church family, anybody in my world, Father God, any Christian, Father God, that's out there, my, my son, my ex-wife, everybody, I want to cover you, Father God, they got those big angels that day, my brother now says, I got the big angels to help me out to protect me from the furious work out of the street, Father God. And uh, I'll be out there to see you and have a strong for you, Father God. Just like, you know, when we were in the world, we did, uh, 